just got them up just to the, get them up here so they're ready and uh, we've been doing a little bit with um, we're running out of stone so we're gonna we're gonna sort this beam out here we're gonna drill it uh, we've got some pieces of wood left some joists they just need trimming down and we'll probably put them in either side and then when we put trusses on we can uh, clip to them I'm not we're probably gonna clip on back uh, whether we clip this side as well, but we'll put uh, we'll put wood in anyway because it's going to be easier to plasterboard even if we don't strap it this side. But yeah, we hope it's stone's going to come tomorrow. Um, so we really need it now. We need to get these up so we can get these lintels on. Right, I think we're going to cut it at 18. So it gets tight at back, it's like 17 left at back. Right, we'll do that. We'll try one at 18. Right, so these are off cuts what we had so we're just going to use these and uh, bolt them in so you don't need to be a first cut really as long as they uh, as long as you go in and bolt up cut both sides it won't go fully through this way <laughs> Absolutely red hot yesterday. <coughs> Said it's going to be red hot today. Yeah. It's raining. <laughs> there we are, tent up to keep tools dry. But it looks like we're going to have to get wet. Yep. Three holes in though. We're doing all right. You want to get uh, two of them bolts, Josh? Josh has just cut a load of briquettes for uh, for on his lintels, so they'll uh, they're ready to go. So we've got fronts cut in, and then uh, back got them bolted, and then what it is when we do this, we don't measure the bolt holes because you can never get them right when you measure. So I'll show you what we do. So what I do is I just get a bit of felt tip pen, get it on end. Basically, become an artist, and then just put it through. You're putting a bit of pressure on that, Josh, and that's it. Then we do that on each hole. So that's it, you can see all the uh, leaves pen marks on them all for us, so nice and easy way to do it, then you know you're right. Good in there. I can see through it. Yeah, look. Oh. We're in. Right, we've got to uh, put a lintel on, use the rest of the stone we've got, we've barely out now, but 
it should be coming this morning so hopefully it'll be uh should be in about half an hour so i'm just gonna we've just got a couple of bricks to sit on there and that is as fine a light and then there's wall plate and then it should just root roof should just tuck under this side go up and then flush at that side uh trust an order should be here next week so we've got this to get up we haven't got a lot of stone to put on there uh get these on lintels on and the back on hey do you want to have a go with me Joe? yeah Start that in, yeah. That's enough, just bed enough for one or two because he ain't cut rest yet. You can bed one and bed a brick on. Get your spread on you. Bed that, yeah. Sit. Make sure it's took line, yeah. And get you want a 10 mil bed, so push it that way. Keep your uh, Keep your trowel in your, in your right hand when you do it, yeah, so it's weird all the time, yeah? Use your trowel, like that. Yeah. I hold it with one hand, yeah, and then I tap with the other. So you just tap that, hold it, hold it, and just tap that corner down there where it's high look. Yeah? Tap back down. And then scrape, scrape off your hover like that. Scrape that. Don't forget your trowel. Hold your trowel in your hand, yeah? And hold it on the tap. There we go. Look at that. See, you're going through this line, look. See how it's a bit low? Just tap this corner up. That's it. Just scrape off now. Scrape front. Is it going to rain again? Huh? Stones turned up. Happy days, we can crack on now. There's some lovely big pieces as well in there. I've been using all scraps so lately. So should be able to get, uh, should go a bit quicker now with decent pieces. So we're just putting a couple in a bag, then hoist it up, and that's how we get them up here. 40 tons we've had. So this is, uh, we'll have had 40 bags, and there's about a ton in each bag. Yeah? This big and on. Now we've got some nice, uh, nice stones. Try and fill back of that in. Let's 
getting these big ones to balance it's hard but they weigh that much and then one for 35 to keep it plump Edge is a bit crap on this one, we'll try and uh, take a little bit off. Good here. Can you find me a one forty, Josh? Fourteen centimeters, it is, yeah. Yeah, try it in. That's your face. Perfect. Lint alert what? <laughs> Lint alert uh, 230. Two thir 130, sorry. One, 130, Josh. You can get me a lintel at 130. Nice and steady. A bit further back, Josh. On back there. Sorted. Sorted. Is it level? Of course Perfect. it is. Is it level that way? Just need a little tap down at back and use that trial. Full of bird poop. <laughs> it's not right. Well, give it one for good luck. <laughs> yeah. Is that my tape you've got in your hand? Oh, oh yeah, it is. <laughs> no, my kiss. Not. <laughs> it's good. Right, I'll have another lint all. Yeah. Oh my god! I nearly dropped my level. Yeah? Let's have a look. Yep, that'll do. A look round here. Yep, that'll do. Is it level? Yep. Good, yes, I'll do. I'm gonna get your hands sorted for the you put it on. Ready? Yeah, go on, I'll lift it middle as well while you're putting it on. 
Three of us. Three of us, Uncle. Just don't step down that big hole, Josh. There's a big hole there. Yeah, yeah this is where you have to stretch straight out. Ready? Yeah, you good. What you like, Uncle. yeah? Good. Sorted. Look at that. Sitting, sitting pretty. This one in. This one's high. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Sitting yeah, pretty now, though, isn't it? Is it level? Hopefully. <laughs> a big test. Yeah, it's good. Yes, we're good, we're good, we're good. So that's it, that's another week out at way. I'll show you uh, what we managed to get done. We did a little bit more off camera. So yeah, we had a really good day today. We all this uh, this stone because it's all new is so much faster. We had Josh cutting and, and placing them on. We had Tim placing them on down there and cutting them. I've just been laying them, so we've got plenty done today. We've made up for a for a rubbish start at week when we we're piddling about. We all rubbish. But yeah, so we've got this corner up. That's ready for lintel. We've just got this big that big drop right back to the. It goes all the way around. So we've got to build that up with stone. Get these two lintels on. But there's not that much in it because it's uh, basically it's pillars. So I don't it'll only take a couple of days that. And then we've got this up. That's ready for wall plate. Probably put a um, hundred short on here. So I might just double it up, double wall plate it instead of trying to squeeze a 50 mil cut under it. We've got these lintels on, lintel on back. So they're all ready. So yeah, we've done very good. So next week we'll do a bit more filming and we'll get it all prepped for roof to go on. All trusses are ordered, they're not going to take long, they said about a week. So a week after, could be putting roof on. If we can get it up and wall plates on and get it ready. So yeah, don't forget to subscribe and uh, that'll be a good one. Yeah, hopefully we've got these uh, trusses measured out right, that's the uh, main problem is uh, we need to make sure they're perfect pretty much. Because we need to be perfect at uh, that side. So it's going to be pretty good, but I'm, I'm, I've looked at plans, I've sent plans through looking pretty good so we've had a quick measure it looks about right so we'll see when they come um hopefully right like it costs three grand so <laughs> but yeah i'm sure there will be so that's it if you're working outside next week don't forget your sun cream i'll be bringing mine see you later